Hello guys, welcome to a new SuperDS video. In this video, I'm going to explain how to work with the automation system and how to make the orders um, being updated on the SuperDS dashboard. So first of all, make sure you already installed the extension. After we install the extension, you can go to the automation section and click in, uh, on this play button. Once you click on this play button, um, SuperDS will automatically fetch every 20 minutes the orders directly from your eBay account. So this is a really big issue. In order to make it work all the time, you have to stay logged into eBay and make your browser open. Okay, don't close your browser if you want the orders to be fetched on the background. Okay, the browser have to stay up and running like this. Um, you don't have to, to go to the extension or anything, just make the browser open because SuperDS extension works with, without any API and work behind the theme. So what we have to do now is to go to the orders. SuperDS will automatically fetch every 20 minutes the orders from eBay directly to this dashboard. So I will give you a brief uh, explanation about this uh, table of orders and I will explain to you what is all these fields. So let's start by uh, the SRN. This is the eBay SRN. These orders are not real. You can see the date, but here you should get a real SRN. Okay. If you click on here, it will go to eBay uh, order. It will automatically open the order on eBay. This is the item name that was sold on your order. This is the sale price of the order, the quantity of the item that the customer bought, the sale date. Here is the information section. You can see the purple, the purple avatar. If you click on here, you can get like a bio information um, with all the fields. You can get the name, zip code, country, uh, address, and and more information to the supplier. Um, if you click here on the mail, you can send a mail directly to the customer. Here you can chat with eBay on eBay. So you just click here and we'll open the chat with the customer with the customer on eBay site. Um, by default, all new old all the all the new orders will be uh, at red will be with red background because red background it's mean like an open status for an order. So if you close an order, if you just uh, already purchased at the supplier the order, you can just click here on the done button and then you can see order updated. So this is just a reminder for you to handle this order. So I will just stick here both of them to show you. You can just change the status back to red again, and if you completed this order, you can just click here. Great. After you get an order, in order to purchase the the item at the supplier, what you want to do is click on here, copy shipping details. Once you click here, it will automatically go to the supplier on AliExpress, and uh, and make you will will make it much easier for you to copy the address it will automatically check on your products and find this item name and buy this item id on ebay it will open the supplier uh, the supplier so for example if i get an order on this microfiber refill it will automatically take me to the supplier here Okay, this is just an example for Walter Drake. But for now, I don't have these orders. As I said, this is like a test account. So if it, if SuperDS can't find a matched item and uh, on the supplier, he will just prompt me, prompt me a message like this. And he said, we couldn't find a supplier link, but shipping details were copied. So he did copy the shipping details from the customer. So what I have to do now is just to go to AliExpress, go to a random product, 
For example, this if this was the order for this uh, Xiaomi Mi Box uh, uh, television control, it will just if I click here, it will just open this uh, open this tab, this new tab um, for me. So you can see this is the information of the con of this. Uh, of the customer, you can see the name, address, city, state, and country, zip code, and phone. So I will just click here on the green, on the green button, and then go to the supplier. Click by now, and instead of manually enter the details of the customer, I just click here on paste order, And it will automatically fetch all the or all the the order uh, details or the customer details, shipping details, directly to AliExpress. So I just have to click save and continue. But remember to recheck the program because still it's a robot, and you can't really be sure this is the correct information. But it should be right, so I just give you a tip to recheck this. So you just click save and continue. And that's all. Place order and have fun. Good luck, guys.